You mean uh, freezing the body and living forever in that sense? I think there's a danger in that, in the sense that you create ice crystals. For example, if you take a look at a fish or a frog, they can be frozen solid over winter time, and springtime you thaw them out, and there they are. They've been frozen solid, and yet they can still swim and jump. Why? We know the answer: glucose. Glucose is an antifreeze. And because these, or, or these animals create lots of glucose in their blood, they're still liquid when the surrounding environment is totally solid. You can freeze a fish in solid ice and it still comes out because inside the metabolic processes are slowly taking place. We do not have this antifreeze. The level of glucose necessary for us to be in suspended animation would kill us. And so during the process of freezing, we have to worry about ice crystals. Ice crystals form inside a cell. As they grow, they rupture the cell wall. That is a big problem facing anyone who's going to be put in liquid nitrogen.